Hi everyone. I went to Tuesday morning in Hobby Lobby today and I figured I'd show you what I found. Now the first thing I'm going to show you is not a crafty item but you know how I love my gnomes. Look at this throw. Is this not adorable? I just, I couldn't pass it up and it was only $12.99. So, yep, it had to go home with me. And then I bought this die set. And I really like it because it has different inserts to go in the egg. And I have to say that, uh, yeah, Tuesday morning is getting a little more expensive with their items. Um, I also found the gift box punch board. And so I got it. Which ought to be fun to play with. And that's pretty much all I got at Tuesday morning. Like I said, they just didn't impress me. And then I went over to Hobby Lobby because they're next door to each other. And I've been looking online and Amazon and all these different places trying to see what the uh, die cutting machines, the ones with wider bases on them are running. And I've been looking at the electric ones thinking maybe that's what I should go with. And I just don't like the price. The price just seems to be a lot higher than what I want it to be. So I was back where the dies were in Hobby Lobby. And I ran across this. Can you see the price? And this has an eight and a half inch base. Look at this. So, I, I couldn't pass it up because I would pay double that no matter what I was doing, even if I went with the Big Shot Plus. So, now I have some dies that I can actually use because they're too big for my Big Shot, but they won't be too big for this. And the thing I like about this one also is it will cut wood, cork, metal, it cuts material denim, all kinds of things. So the possibilities are endless. So I only got a couple of Valentine's things. I picked up one of these the little shakers. And everybody loved the embellishment I did in my binder with the monkeys. So I had to go pick up another monkey. And then I found these little hearts that are all multicolored glittered up. And of course, all of these were 40% off. And then Susan, to see Pecker, the enabler, showed us yesterday that she got these little love heart sequins. So I picked those up. And then I found some that was flamingos and pineapples. And it has yellow, just plain yellow uh, sequins in there with it. And then this one, of course, would be the one that Alicia would absolutely fall in love with. It's all llamas and cactuses in different colors. And then I had never seen this one before, so it was really cool that I found it. And it is puzzle pieces and little teeny tiny hearts, which are apparently out of the puzzle pieces. So I thought that was pretty good. Then, 
I just, I couldn't pass these up. They're going to be fun to do. And now that I got those markers from Susan Tootsie Tucker, I think I'm going to color them with those. And the main reason I went in there was to look for the, the little gummy bear molds. And mine had none. But I found these. And they're the girls in wood. And they're pretty good size. And you get six different designs. So I thought, wow, that's pretty awesome. So I picked those up. And then Paper Studio is 50% off. So I got this one. And it comes with the ephemera and the stickers. So it was only four dollars and well five dollars four dollars and ninety nine cents and then this was in the clearance and it's assorted sheets and it was tickets and this one was three ninety nine and I don't know what the other sheets look like because they tell you not to open the package so let me open the package so we can see what they all are. What the assortment is. So it's a bunch of the tickets and then the other is a pretty purple with uh, paisley. So those are fun to make cards and stuff like that. So I got that. And then I have the LOL paper pad that I got last year on clearance. And they had the kit for $8.99 originally, and it's 50% off. And it comes with all of the die cuts and the stickers and those papers. So I thought I did pretty good. My, my best thing as far as crafting goes was finding the platinum. And it's a pretty good size machine. And what I like about it is that it folds up and becomes compact. So it won't take up as much room. So that is awesome. Now I'm going to get busy and play with it here short. So that was what I got today. I hope I found something that you guys are looking for and you know to go there and see if you can find it. And I hope the rest of your day is awesome. Have a good one. Bye now.